Hi, welcome to online digital marketing training. In this video, I'm going to explain how to make changes to your Google Ads. There are many changes. I've seen many people are asking these questions. So I'm going to explain all these things. So how to change the currency, account name, account type, bid, language, and all these options. Let us start with one by one. Google Ads currency. So not only currency, country, currency, time zone. These things you will set at the account level. Account level. So when you're starting your account, this is your account. When you're setting up your account, it will ask you country and currency and time zone. These things cannot be changed later. So be careful when you're doing, you can't change it. So there is no answer for this. You can't change your currency. If it is in dollars, it is dollar. Today only one of my students asked me questions. So I'm managing my uh, Canada client and uh, account is created from Canada only. So do I have to target Canada dollar or something else? So whatever you choose, if you choose initially at the account level Canada dollar, it will be Canada only, Canada dollar. You can't change it to Indian rupees. Okay. No, you want to, uh, you want amount to directed in rupees, then better create a new account. I'm not asking you about a new Gmail account. With one Gmail account, 20 ad accounts you can create. So there is an option, new ad account. At this time, whatever the currency you want, you can take it. But the existing one, you can't change it. So someone searching for this question, if you want to change the currency, not possible. How to change Google Ads account name? Account name in the sense, here, this is a number 337-446-06. There is my client BTQ. The client name is BTQ. If you want to change it, how to do it? So in order to go that, click on tools and settings. There is an option. Under setup, there is an option preferences. Actually, you have to give a name. A number of times you can change the name. As of now, the account is still looking like a 337446 like this. But it's better to name it. Now I'm going to name it. Either you can name it or you can change it. Both same option. Tools, under setup, there is an option called preferences. There, you will be changing it. Just can you see your account name? As of now, there is no account name. So just clicking on this and I'm naming as ODMT ads account this is the name that everyone who has access to this account will see anytime you can come back and you can change it you can change your account name simple come back here and you can remove it add the new one that's it now i will show you it will reflect now i'm going to refresh this and i will show you the name yes you can observe now there is an account name ODMT ads account. So this is how you can change the account name. Google ads account type. What do you mean by account type? See, uh, there are two kinds of accounts. One is business account. One is individual account. If it is an individual and not registered, then what happened, whatever the amount you spend, my daily budget is 3000 now. Among that, some tax amount will be deducted. Obviously, Google Ads is not mandatory, right? It's not a basic requirement. So you're spending amount. So based on that, government will take some tax on that. I think 18% they're deducting actually. So you are individual and not registered, that 18% will be deducted. If it is a business and you're registered one, there is a possibility you can escape it because you're already paying your GST. So if you are individual or business, how to change it? These options will be available on the tools and settings. So here the billing section will be there. If you want, whenever you want, you can go and change the settings. That's very simple anyway. But anyway, uh, if you are already business, you a business registered one, you never go to this option anyway. But later you have it, come back here and the settings, change it 
next how to change google ads bid bidding so here cpc is the same question how to change google ads cpc or google ads bid both are the same thing so let me show you how to do that for this click on campaign so here you'll be getting many answers there are many questions with this option you will be getting a solution click on campaign then odmt search ads i'm clicking on this now left hand side you have an option called settings you can click on this or else come top here you have an option there is an option called more details it's a drop down click on this both options are fine either you can click on left hand side settings but you have to come to the ad group level then click on this now see here you can change start and end date timing location language these are all things you're going to change now people are asking right location budget these are all you can go to change it so you can change your uh, start and end date which timing your location you can change your language also can change and bid strategy also you can change so i'm clicking on edit in settings right yes uh, because of my previous campaign results i have to make some changes i'm going to show you what changes i'm going to do right now and in the further videos also how these changes have impacted on my campaign and how I, how i got benefit also i'm going to show you yes so even you can change campaign name here so whenever you want to change the campaign name come back here and remove it add your new campaign name okay and campaign status is enabled uh, networks by default my ad is appearing on the search network if you want to add it in the search partners so always check it but i recommend not to do that location india so the problem with my result is i'm getting good business from hyderabad bangalore and delhi uh, different parts of the states different states uh, people are clicking but they are not converting due to many reasons so as of now i don't want to waste my money that's why what i'm doing is i'm coming back here instead of india i'm selecting the another location so there is a question in google ads uh, certification exam also how many locations you can target in a google ads campaign okay n number of locations you can target so how to do that so i'm searching i'm typing hyderabad now people who are in hyderabad can see my ad see hyderabad telangana targets done now i can add one more one more location now see another location in such a way multiple locations you can target i'm going to bangalore now so bangalore targets in such a way multiple locations i can target as of now i'm doing with these two i'll be adding a delhi also delhi target in these three cases now i told you uh, again i want people who are in this place only want to see this so by default people here are searching for this location also by default this option will be there make sure that people in or regularly in your target location that is a good option and once you make click on the save button now i've changed the location you are removing some locations continue with this change yes so location changed next budget language language i'm targeting english audience it's fine if i don't want again i can change it budget as of now 3000 per day if you want you can change the budget also you want to increase 4000 5000 or 
it's your wish you can do it now this is what bidding some people ask me how to change uh, bid or cpc and uh, one more option bid strategy option also there these are all one answer bid bid strategy or cpc here as of now bidding automatic bidding max cpc i'm doing now if you don't want this click on this this is the best method guys if you're running search network 100% this will work for you you don't have to go for anything so come back here change bid strategy so click on the change bid strategy whatever the strategy you want you can select it see here in the drop down you can choose options like target cpa target ROAS, maximize conversion maximize conversion value target impression say or a manual cpc bidding again uh, about these bid strategies i've already made video go back to my youtube channel type you odmt on youtube you will find my all playlist also google ads playlist you will find i'll try to put a link in the description go through this i prefer maximize skills so if you want to change this you can change any time there is no problem you can change your uh, bid strategy now can i change my cpc yes you can change your cpc here it is 100 if you want you can make 120 or if you want to reduce it to 20 you can do it so this is how we can do it but i don't want to do it now only for your information i'm doing it 100 my max cpc is 100 so just click on the save button see guys this is for the entire campaign and even for each and every keyword also you can change i'm going to show you now how to go to keyword and change that uh, cpc keyword level also you can do it now start and end date you can always change the start and end date it's already started anyway next click on additional settings few more options are there now my ad is start and end the date okay i don't have a problem with this okay these are the things i've done now i want to go for an ad schedule I initially thought to go from 10 a.m. to uh, 10 p.m. model, but I thought to check. But when I did 12 morning, 12 a.m. also ad run, but I didn't get a good result. So I want to stop my ad on those timings. So at the time, how to restrict it? I'm going to show you. Left hand side, there is an option called ad schedule. Yes. So as of now your ads are eligible to show all the time i want to change this then how to change it so edit ad schedule so all days instead of starting from 12 a.m I'm, I'm going for 10 a.m model now so morning 10 o'clock my ads will start and i want to end by 22 means 10 pm it is because of the analytics what i understood is between 10 to 10 people are active there is no invalid uh, clicks that's why i want to run my ads from 10 to 10 am to 10 pm model where if you want you can extend to 23 because these days nobody is sleeping before 12 some important sessions will come so i'm going to for 23 yeah save so till 11 o'clock my ad will appear let's see how it works so now i've changed the location uh, and uh, timings also have changed this is the ma major changes you can see this is done currency i told you it's not possible account name done and uh, account type also done and uh, and bid bid strategy cpc it is also done now someone asking how to change google ads id they want to change this id you can't change this id man if you want you can create a new id that is also by default given by the google 
location is done that's just now now how to change the keywords and the landing page so go to keywords left hand side then you click keywords you'll find the keywords so these are all the keywords now whenever you want you can add a new keyword so click on the plus symbol and add a new keyword so in this ad group so what are the keyword you want you can add it here whether it is broad match phrase match exact match or broad match modifier you can do it but whatever it is there exist one you want to change now this is the exact match you want to change it to phrase match click on edit see what do you want to make it you can change it to phrase match or broad match this is how we can change it okay because i i selected as a max epc here the uh, bidding option is not coming but if it is another bidding type manual bidding you can change the bid also here if it is max epc it will apply for every keyword here but if it's a manual cpc even at keyword level also you have a control you can change it so this is how you can change now even bulk actions also can do it select all of them and edit change match types from broad match to exact match or phrase match what do you want bulk changes also we can do it this is how we can change the keywords finally landing page landing page seems it will be there in the ads go to ads and extension there you will be having a landing page so previously uh, you gave one landing page now you want to change it so how to do it now this one you want to do it right uh, select now see if you want to pause something select pause if you want to delete it select edit and remove okay you can copy many things are there now i want to edit it we said also there is an option click on edit edit now here you can remove the landing page url here and whatever you want you can mention it see here my ad looking like i have a ad extra description it's a call out extension this is site link extension this is a call extension so always uh, suggested that uh, you have to use extensions clear so with this uh, i think i have uh, given answers these are all the questions asked by people i've seen in the google suggest that's why i have made a video on this and if you have any questions put it in the comment so that i'll make a video on that also so actually for my account uh, simply i will show one thing what is the best way to uh, change it first click on the campaign this is the campaign right you can create a new campaign and if you want to pause the campaign click on pause if you want to delete the campaign click and delete the campaign remove now you are at campaign level so this is the account level the account all the campaigns will be there when you click on the campaign you will see ad group level now this is one ad group if you want you can create another ad group also and you can pause and remove it when you click on ad group you will see the keyword level these are all the keywords here also multiple keywords you can add but for ads separately you have to click on ads and extension and go there okay hey guys that's it now i made some changes i'll be waiting for 24 hours let's see how the benefit is and how many conversions are increased i'm going to show you in the next video so thank you very much guys if you have any questions uh, feel free to ask me and if anybody looking for a training so this is my website you can call this number or send an email so that we will get back to you thank you very much guys